Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2020 Corvette Coupe 2LT with Z51 mag ride and front lift. This one is in Sebring orange metallic with the uh, two-tone sky cool gray and black interior. Let's start at the rear here. We got the uh, rear hood open here. So being the coupe, you got the glass there through the hood. And then here's your engine itself. It's the 6.2 liter V8 that produces 495 horsepower. It's paired to an eight speed dual clutch automatic transmission. You can see it has the uh, exposed carbon fiber engine dress up kit there. And we also have the orange engine cover really pops against with the uh, orange on the car. Uh, right behind here, we have our rear trunk and this has the uh, glass removable roof in the trunk. Uh, when the roof is on the car, uh, you gain this space and you can actually fit uh, two golf bags back here or other items if you want to go shopping or whatever. Uh, and it, again, it is the glass roof, so nice roof. And we have the uh, carbon flash race stripes on it as well. So let's close the rear hood here. We'll zoom out here so you can see the roof off there. And back here, you can see the rear camera mirror there. And then here's your engine. There's that orange engine cover, it really pops with the orange. And you can really see that engine. Coming back here, you can see those full length carbon fiber, carbon flash. Uh, race stripes. Uh, we have the carbon flash uh, badge pack. So there's your stingray. And coming back here, we have the high wing uh, painted body color with those uh, stripes uh, incorporated. Down below, we have the NPP performance exhaust. Uh, that comes with the Z51 performance package. Uh, and that allows you to change the exhaust note from loud to quiet or vice versa. And you can do that electronically in the, the cabin of the car as you're driving. Really cool feature on these Corvettes. Okay, coming to the rear wheels. Uh, we have the Michelin tires all the way around this car. It's a 30530 ZR20 in the rear. Uh, and then we have the black Trident wheels uh, and the uh, yellow brake calipers, as you can see there, with those performance brakes that come with the Z51 package. Okay, moving to the front wheel. Uh, you can see uh, the brakes are larger in the front. Uh, and again, those yellow calipers are really bright. They really stand out. Uh, we have uh, Corvette and Z51 written on those calipers as well. Uh, rear tire size is a 245. I can find it here. Uh, a 245 35ZR19 in the front. All right. Oh, we also have the black lug nuts there. And coming to the interior, so two-tone interior. So most of the door panel is black, as you can see here. We have the gray stitching here. It's a baseball stitch. And then here's your sky cool gray uh, armrest here. It's almost a white, but it's, uh, it is gray. Uh, we have the Bose Performance Series sound system, the memory package for the passenger, power windows, power locks, and electronic door release. Show you the dash on this side here. So you can see that gray stitching there on the black dash. Uh, we'll open the glove box here. Oh, we'll need the key for that. So we'll wait uh, till we get to the other side. Um, we have the door jams here. They're nice and tidy. There's your stingray kick plate. Uh, so with the stingray there, that's pretty neat. And we have uh, clean jams there. Here's your uh, premium carpeted floor mats. These are the upgraded stingray ones. And then we have the uh, eight-way power seats. So you got power bolster and lumbar as well. Now let's scan the condition of the seat. Again, the two-tone. So the outside is the sky cool gray. And then we have the black Alcantara seat inserts. And again, these are the GT2 seats. So you got the exposed carbon fiber here and the whole back is carbon fiber. Corvette flags here. And then the Alcantara on the side of the headrest here. Bright orange seat belts, match that paint. Really striking. We have the speaker grill there and then we got the wireless charging station for your cell phones there and then right between the seats your engine bay so you got a glass partition there and then there's your engine again that orange really pops and the exposed carbon fiber you can see there too really cool close this door here show the profile of this high wing here again all in body color let's walk down the car here as you can see the seats really make an impact 
we got the orange side mirrors here and this car also has all the orange um, body vents as well as you can see so it's kind of a monotone and down here the orange vents there and we have the uh, front splitter here let's walk to the front here front trunk is open so under the lid nice and clean and then here's your trunk bay uh, so like put my hand in here it goes pretty deep so you can fit a luggage bag in here we have the cargo net in here here's a 12 volt socket so that's where you would plug your uh, battery tender for your battery engine coolant add and windshield wiper add there let's close this front hood and we'll step back and then we'll come into the paint here so the car hasn't been polished yet but it's, the paint is still shiny there's a little bit of uh, uh, marks on the paint uh, that will come out with a, a clay bar so we're not too worried about that overall the paint is in great condition i don't see uh, any really stone chips and another thing this car is uh, protected with paint protective film so the whole front bumper the whole entire hood and the front fenders are uh, done in the paint protective film you can really feel it here so it protects the paint uh, and then we have the bright LED headlights there. We'll see them on in a bit. Here's your front wheel there. And your rear wheel here. So they all look good. Back to the door panel. So again, the black panel, the gray armrest here. You got the Bose Performance Series sound system. You got the memory package for the driver. You got your power mirrors. You got power folding mirrors. I'll hit that there so you can see them function. And back out again. We also have blind spot monitoring, so that'll light up if something's in your blind spot. And I also see the PPF um, right on the mirrors there as well. We got the power windows here, power locks, electronic door release, front and rear trunk. I'll show you the dash on this side. There's your slot for your heads up display. It does have heads up. And again, back to the jams. They look good. Kick plate looks pretty good here. I like that Stingray logo right there. And back to the pedals, carpeted floor mats, your eight-way power seat. So you got power bolster and lumbar. And we'll scan the seat here. So again, the Alcantara inserts and the sky cool gray. And the exposed carbon fiber. And of course, those bright orange seat belts. Okay, let's hop in the car now. And we'll go through uh, some of the features so we got the nice vents here they're nice and sleek we have the heads up display controls here down below we have your dash dimming lights and electronic parking brake over here we got your power tilt and telescopic steering wheel uh, up on the wheel here you got headlight controls here's your uh, paddle shift for your downshift the z button takes you to your performance pages uh, cruise control settings and we have audio on both sides here heated steering wheel bluetooth voice command your arrow keys for your digital dash your upshift for the paddle shifter and then your windshield wipers over here go ahead and start the car it's push button start and before i forget we'll open that glove box so you can see the uh, owner's manual over there and the wheel lock nut close that back up again so we'll zoom out here so you can see that steering wheel so it's an alcantara steering wheel a nice upgrade it's got the black leather center point there uh, we have your bump outs here and it's got the black stitching and we got the flat bottom here the corvette flags in the center we'll zoom into that digital dash so it's a full cluster that's digital uh, mileage on this car is 15,542 kilometers okay up on the visor here you can see the universal garage door opener here we have the rear camera mirror uh, you can flip that off if you like so it's got the light sensitive mirror there and then we also have the uh, tinted eyebrow here, as well as the, the windows are tinted as well. Okay, coming down here, we got an eight inch touch screen. So here's your icons, we'll go over a few. So navigation, so you got factory nav there, back home again. We got a Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. Uh, we got performance data recorder. There it is there. Um, and then you got climate controls and front camera. I'll hit the front camera here so you can see there we go so there's your front of your car so you can see your different angles of the car when you're approaching something uh throw in reverse so you can see it has a reverse camera there 
I like how you can see the stripes there. That's pretty cool. Coming down here, we got your automatic transmission controls. It's a push-pull design. Uh, M puts you in your manual mode, so you can use those cool paddle shifters. Up here, we got some extra keys. So we got traction control, and it does have front lift with memory. So this button will raise the axle an inch. So if you're approaching something that's a little uh, higher in clearance, I would hit that so you get a little more clearance. Front camera, so that gives you to goes takes you to your front camera really quickly. And then you got your mode selector here, so it's a dial. Uh, and then we'll come into the dash here, so you can see I'll turn it all the way to the beginning. So weather mode is the beginning. Uh, we have my mode, so you can customize it. You got tour mode, sport mode, and track mode. And that sport and track also open the exhaust up, so it's louder. Uh, coming down here, we have your sky cool uh, interior feature here we got two cup holders here and then along the tower here you got dual zone climate control heated and ventilated seats and the rest of your climate controls here uh, down here we got a black console cover i'll open it up here put my hand in here so you can see how deep it is we have the auxiliary and usb here as well okay let's open up this door here i'll turn on the headlights and let's give it a couple revs It's a high RPM once it hits that lick. Sounds great. All right, we'll walk to the front of the car here. Show you those headlights on. You can see it looks great. Those seats really pop. As we walk down the side of the car here. This is Sebring orange, so it still has the metallic to it. I like the new Amplify Orange, which is just a tint coat. A lot of people still prefer this color. And then we got the uh, bright LED tail lights there. And then here's your exhaust at idle. Just sounds great. All right, so here we have it. This is a 2020 Corvette Coupe 2LT with Z51 Meg right and front lift in Sebring Orange with the Sky Cool and black interior. This is here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come down and have a look at this one for yourself. We look forward to seeing you real soon.